ABH subculture gives us dust, Desi and Katie give us sparkle, and Smashbox gives us the finger? I'm Jen from Jen Loves Reviews, and What's a Vin Makeup starts now. Welcome to What's a Vin Makeup for August 6th, 2017. Let's get started with the top industry news. Not long ago, Anastasia Beverly Hills Cosmetics was known only for their amazing brow products, but with eyeshadow palette releases such as the Master Palette by Mario and the now legendary Modern Renaissance Palette, ABH showed everyone that they were a force to be reckoned with in the eyeshadow market. The long-awaited release of the Modern Renaissance sister palette called Subculture happened on July 25th, followed very soon by a plethora of reviews on YouTube. There's one big consensus. The shadows are abnormally powdery. The first person, to our knowledge, to point this out was a very disappointed Alyssa Ashley. As of today, if you search YouTube for subculture palette review, you'll see thumbnail after thumbnail clearly expressing disappointment in the quality of the palette. So what does ABH have to say about this? President Claudia Soar, also known as Norvina, stated that this was their first First time using an automatic pressing machine. When the shadows aren't pressed hard enough, the result is a dusty mess. The question is, what is ABH doing about this? Will this be a continuing problem or is there hope for subculture? ABH says customers can feel free to return their palettes for a full refund. If you ordered within the US, you can use the return label enclosed with your order. You'll receive email notification once the return has been received and the refund will be issued within seven to 10 business days. As for for future subculture palettes, Norvina assured customers on Twitter that future palettes will be pressed harder. What are your thoughts on subculture? Do you feel ABH is handling the situation well? And what are your thoughts about ordering this palette? We'd love to know in the comments below. It's official, Desi Perkins and Katie DeGroot, also known as Luster Lux, are collabing with Dose of Colors on some beautiful products. The collection will include two highlighters, an eyeshadow palette, and five lip products. The palette will be $28 and contains four shades named after their dogs. Two of the lip products are matte liquid shades and two are matte cream shades and one is a gorgeous gold glittery gloss. Prices range from $15 to $18 for each lip product. Finally, the two highlighters are also $28 and are described as champagne golden shades. Official launch date is August 14th. Here's a story that starts and ends with fingers. Foundation wearers are always looking for a new hot tool to achieve the flawless airbrush look. They may have started with their fingers, then brushes, then sponges, and maybe even the silicone sponges. Now Smashbox has designed yet another silicone sponge with a twist. Get up close and you will see little ridges all over it in centric patterns. So now we've gone from fingers emulating sponges to sponges that emulate fingers. Could this $20 sponge change your foundation game? YSL is receiving some backlash from people of color regarding the shade range of their new All Hours Foundation. Looking at this photo, it's apparent that deeper skin tones have been left out of production. After some confrontation on Instagram, the brand responded with this. Thank you for your comments. Your feedback is important to us and we take it very seriously. We are pleased to let you know that five new darker shades are already set to join the range next year. Instagram user and What's Up and Makeup community member P.S. Ty summed up her feelings and the feelings of many other POC with this. So, WOC won't buy or wear makeup. Should I post a pic of my beauty room to show you differently? Nah, we're good because there will be five new shades next year to accompany your 20 shades of porcelain. Yay. For months, we've been updating when and where Rihanna's line Fenty Beauty will be launching. Details have now been released. Mark your calendars as Rihanna herself announced on Instagram that the line will be available at Harvey Nichols and Sephora stores as well as Sephora.com and FentyBeauty.com starting September 8th. The Saks Beauty Reward Program has been unveiled at the iconic department store, but it's a program with some catches along the way. First, in order to be a member, you must have a Saks First credit card. Once you spend your first $250, you will then get your welcome reward in the form of a beauty box from Saks Beauty Team. The program then continues on a tier system. Once you hit $500, $750, and $1,000, you'll receive another box with more perks. All in all, the boxes might not be exactly free, but if you're a person that loves trying out new luxury products, 
products, then the rewards program may be for you. You might remember back in May when we told you about the upcoming collab between L'Oreal and Balmain, you saw the pics that Oliver Roosting posted of several metallic and matte lipsticks. Now at last, we have a sneak peek from L'Oreal. The brand posted to their Instagram a photo of Confidence, a stunning sparkly rose gold lipstick. This is one of the 12 shades, including reds, pinks, plums, and berries. The collab is set to hit the market in September. And speaking of L'Oreal, they have partnered with You Can Makeup, an augmented reality app to integrate its makeup collections. According to L'Oreal, this offers hundreds of millions of beauty lovers the opportunity to virtually experience makeup collections from L'Oreal's brands, learn about the products, and shop through the app or in store. This is not meant to replace L'Oreal's already popular Makeup Genius app. There are many ads on TV, online, and Facebook for genetic testing. Most seek to find their ancestry, but could a DNA test help you find something closer to your cotton ball? DNA Diagnostic Center recently announced that its new home DNA line of consumer genomics testing kits will not only test for healthy weight, ancestry, and paternity, but also test for skin care. The skin care test yields a report meant as a guide for both products and routines. It examines 28 genes influencing skin's appearance to help determine properties including skin appearance and aging. Of course, lifestyle and product choices are definite factors, but the Home DNA Skin Care Analysis Plus report suggests that genetics and products can work in tandem for even more visible results. And it's been a while since we had one of these, so get ready for the latest update from the Lisa Frank and Glamour Dolls Kickstarter. The latest product is a travel size bitten and bronzed matte bronzer, pigmented, universally flattering, and perfectly pocket sized, according to Glamour Dolls. They say the Trapper Keeper palette artwork should be finalized any day now, and we cannot wait to see it. This week in Makeup and Beauty events, BeautyCon LA is coming next weekend, August 12th and 13th. Tickets are available from $49.99 to $349.99. And in money saving deals this week, Pure has released the mystery bag number 105 called Poolside Glow Getters. Mystery bags contain at least $100 in Pure products and contain five new or best selling products and at least one full size item. It's a pure mystery. All sales are final and cannot be combined with any other promotional offers. No exchanges. These bags are good while supplies last and are limited to two per person. If you purchase two bags, they can't guarantee that you'll get different bags due to product availability. Supplies are limited. Costco is currently selling the eight count of the Skin Iceland Hydro Cool Firming Eye Gels for $30 at Durham Store, $9.97 at Costco.com. Shipping is included. And our last deal for today is at Sephora. They have the Sephora Favorites Quench Your Skin on sale for $39. It's an $88 value. Included in the favorite set are hydrating full or deluxe size products from Sunday Riley, Drunk Elephant, Belief, and more. And here come the product reports, starting with Sephora. If you're cool with the powder, Anastasia's subculture palette is still available at Sephora's website, $42. 14 shades featuring grungy mattes and bold metallics with an underground edge. Along with that, Anastasia Beverly Hills Liquid Glow Highlighter is $25 in four shades. Bare Minerals released their Good Hydration Silky Face Primer for $28. Seven new releases in shade extensions from Tom Ford. First, the Tom Ford Ultra Shine Lip Gloss, $47, available in 10 shades. Ultra Length Mascara, $45. Extreme Mascara, also $45. Eye Color Quad, $85. 10 quad options now available. Complexion Enhancing Primer, $75 in two shades, designed to enhance your complexion by hydrating and minimizing pores and brightening the skin's undertone. Finally, we have the Traceless Foundation Stick for $85 in nine shades and the Waterproof Foundation and Concealer, also $85. It comes in 12 shades. Huda Beauty released her limited edition highlighter palette called Summer Solstice. You get four fresh summer shades designed to create a buildable, endless sunset on your cheeks. And now a few items exclusive to Sephora. First, we have the Josie Marin Argan Moonstone Drops Makeup Priming and Highlighting Oil. How's that for a name? $48. Next, Paracone MD released the No Makeup Instant Blur this week, 
$25. And the Kiehl's Butter Lip Treatment, $25. It comes in six shades. They're $19.50 each. First Day Beauty released the Hello Fab Mango Butter Multi Stick for $20. Currently sold in two shades. A third shade is coming in October. Wander Beauty's Lip Setter Dual Lipstick and Liners, $28. It does come in five shades. And finally, NARS has released the Board de Plage Highlighting and Bronzing Palette for $59. It's exclusive to Sephora and limited edition. Comes with four opalescent highlighters and two sun wash diffusing bronzers. This week at Ulta from Anastasia Beverly Hills, the matte lipsticks, $18, available in 30 shades. I am wearing one today. It is the shade Rum Punch, but I put some shine over top of it. It is matte without the shine. Also the Liquid Glow for $25. This is what that looks like. And the Subculture Eyeshadow Palette, $42, is now online at Ulta as well and in stores August 15th. Benefits Go Go Tint Bright Cherry Tinted Lip and Cheek Stain is $30. It's a cherry red lip and cheek stain. From Lash Food Online Only, we have the Lash Transformation System for $95. Brow Food Brow Transformation System, $98, available in light medium and medium dark. And from Dose of Colors, this is online only, the Mint Ideal Duo Collection, $25, two shade choices. It is cruelty-free, talc-free, paraben-free, and gluten-free. Then the Mint Ideal Crayon Collection, $18, two shade choices there. And the Mint Pressed Powder Blush Collection, $20. $22 available in two shades. Mint Matte Liquid Lipstick Collection is $18. Applies creamy but dries to a matte finish. And a lot from IT Cosmetics available online today and in stores October 1st. The Bye Bye Breakout is $28. It's a drying lotion and concealer in one in seven shades. Bye Bye Breakout Powder, $28 available in three choices. Clear, light, medium, and tan rich. Then Bye Bye Lines Foundation, $38. Sheer to medium coverage in seven shades from fair to deep. Next, we have the Bye Bye Under Eye Concealing Pot, $28, available in six shades. The Bye Bye Redness, Redness Erasing Correcting Powder for $38 in three shades. Bye Bye Pores Illumination, $29. The Perfect Lighting Radiant Touch Magic Wand is $29. It corrects, conceals, and brightens, available in three shades. And finally, the Your Skin But Better CC Plus Airbrush Perfecting Powder Illumination. Man, these names are long. SPF 50 Plus, it's $35. Give it gives you a lit from within finish available in seven shades from fair to deep. Next up from Tarte, the Lip Wardrobe Volume 2 is $20. It's a try me kit of Tartist lippies from Bare Minerals, like we saw at Sephora, the Good Hydration Silk Face Primer or the Combo Control Milky Face Primer, $26 each. You can hydrate or mattify, whatever fits your needs. From Ofra Online Only Dazzling Diamond Professional Makeup Palette or Must Have Matte Professional Makeup palette, $59 each. Each palette includes 20 eyeshadow shades. Next, the blush stripes, $25 in three color choices. And the 3D Pyramid Blush or 3D Pyramid Bronzer, those are $29 each. Americano Bronzer, $25. And the Versatile Matte Bronzer, $25. And finally, the Ofra and Manny MUA Lip Set is available for $35. It's honestly one of my favorite sets of lip products that I own. Those color Colors call to you, I highly recommend it. From MAC, the MAC Girls palettes, each with shadows and highlights. Choose from Basic Bitch, Mischief Minx, Prissy Princess or Power Hungry, $39.50 each. Butter London's Plush Rush Satin Matte Lipsticks are $22, available in eight new shades. From Japanesque, the Kumadori Highlighter is $22, and the Kumadori Matte Liquid Lipsticks are $20 in two shades. Kumadori Loose Finishing Powder, $32. And new from Lipstick Queen, we have the Black Lace Rabbit Blush for $25. It's a black blush that turns sheer bare on the cheek, kind of similar to the Frog Prince formula that they have, just black to berry. Next, they have the Smoky Lip Kit, $35, includes the Black Lace Rabbit Lipstick and Sinner in Mauve. And finally, the Nothing But Nudes is $24, available in three shades. Next, we move on to Botanic Farm. They have a soft cover pore balm primer for $18. They call it a dual purpose primer that claims to prevent 
acne. And you know we've got your DWPs. We got you one per customer while supplies last. Receive a free deluxe sample of Brow Vogue Conditioning Primer with any $35 benefit purchase. Receive a complimentary deluxe statement lip in VIP with any $40 bare minerals purchase and a complimentary 10 day supply fall slash extreme black mascara sample with any MAC purchase. This is online only. In high end news this week at Nordstrom, Charlotte Tilbury released the Hot Lips lipstick set for $60. Two lipsticks and one liner available in nude or pink. Estee Lauder Pure Envy Sheer Matte Sculpting Lipstick, $32 available in 10 shades. And Bergdorf Goodman, the Cledipo Limited Edition Lipstick, $65. Luxurious lipstick with petal shaped tip. And in drugstore news this week, lots of new items from e.l.f. Here are the highlights. Matte to Metal Eye Primer, $4. Transforms everyday shadow into a luminous look in glimmering gold, twinkling taupe, and shimmering silver. Liquid Lip Primer, $4. Enriched with vitamin E. Next, the Photo Ready Set, $12. Includes high definition powder and pointed powder brush. Starlight Highlighter and Brush Duo, $12. Correct and Blend Trio, $13. Includes two color correcting sticks and a sponge. Beautifully Bare Foundation Serum SPF 25 is $8. Now in two new shades, Deep and Dark Deep. Water Droplet Balm, $10. A lightweight moisturizer that transforms from balm to water. Beautifully Precise Swirl Foundation Brush, $10. A swirled rose-shaped brush with a fluid reservoir. These things are so interesting. Mini Glam case $4, perfect for storing up to four lipsticks or whatever you like. And from NYX, available online only, we have the Night on the Town palette, $49.99 with 74 eyeshadows and three pressed pigments, four blushes, three highlights, and two contours. Beauty Stable palette is also $49.99, 36 eyeshadows, four pressed pigments, two blushes, and a highlight contour pair. Beauty on the Go palette is also $49.99, $49.99 includes 31 eyeshadows, five pressed pigments, seven lip creams, six powder highlights and contours, and three blushers. And these NYX items are available in stores. We have the Precision Brow Pencil, $9.99 in eight shades. Build em Up Powder Brow Filler, $7.99 in eight shades. Liquid Suede Metallic Cream Lipsticks are here, $7.49 comes in 12 shades. And from JCat Beauty, these are available online only. The Santa Monica 25 Shadow Eye palette $17.99 and from Essence Metal Shock Lipstick for $4.99 in seven shades. From Sleek Major Matte Ultra Smooth Matte Lip Cream $7.99 in nine shades. Blush $5.99 in four shades. Mattifying Primer or Hydrating Primer $10.99 and finally just so you know Sleek Makeup is now available at Walgreens but it looks like right now everything is available online only. At QVC where sunshine or storm there's always $3 shipping, Clinique Brow Shaper, $17. Fine Press Powder with a special brush in your choice of four shades. Lipstick Queen's Bella Polk Lip Balm, $20. A non-sticky balm rich in algae extract in your choice of three subtle shades. Bare Minerals Bare Pro Liquid Foundation with Lux Brush is $43.64 with up to 24 hour wear in a range of 17 matte finish shades. From Mali, Carefree Color 3 Piece Kit, $35.46 includes Perfect Press Prep, neutralizing Primer, Evercolor Shadow Stick Extra, and the Blushing Brilliance Blush and Highlighter Wand. The Pro Perfect Brush System, $31.86 with Evercolor Brow Defining Gel, Evercolor Shadow Stick Extra, and Double Ended Brow Grooming Brush. It comes in three shades. And finally, today's special value from Monday, August 7th, 2017 will be the Peter Thomas Roth Super Size Retinol and Firm X Four Piece Kit, $139 plus free shipping for Super Size versions of your anti-aging favorites. And in Indian cruelty free news this week, Colored Rain has released their satin lipsticks in shades Cherry Blossom, Soul Socialite, Charmed Empathy, Foxy Lady, and Cameo. Cruelty free, vegan, and gluten free, $17 each. Huda Beauty will release their Faux Filter Foundation collection in October, which will include the Complexion Perfection Primer, Faux Filter Foundation, and Face Blending Brush. The foundation will be available in 30 shades and sell for $40. And here's a look 
look at the outer packaging for Huda's Desert Dusk eyeshadow palette set. It is set to release on September 18th. Makeup Monsters showed a first look at the finished packaging for their new vegan and cruelty-free hair dye coming late fall. They also want to send a first look at the upcoming faux eyelashes. More details to come. Melt's Hot Box collection was released last week and now features lipsticks and liners. The lipsticks come in Cherry and Mary Jane and are vegan $19 each. All day, everyday lip liners are available in Edible, Kink, and Santeria. They are also vegan and $17 each. All day, everyday eyeliners come in 420, Baked, Bloodshot, and RX Queen, which are vegan, and 818, which is non-vegan, $17 each. Stash them all in the Melt Pouch, available in Indigo, Mustard, or Burgundy. Those are $10 each. From Touch of Glam Beauty comes the Blue Bell Silky Rains Highlighter, a unicorn-inspired violet pink aqua teal shimmer that sells for $23.50. They also have the Chrome Collection Bundle on offer with 26 millimeter sizes of seven ultra-foiled eyeshadows, $36.50. Individual pans are available for $5 to $8 each. All products are vegan, cruelty-free, paraben-free, and talc-free. And now, it's that time again, the sneak peeks lightning round. In three, two, one. Storybook Cosmetics sends this sneak peek of the Wizardry and Wish Trap Lip Edition launching this fall. And here's a first look at the Storybook Cosmetics in Mean Girls Wednesday We Wear Pink Eyeshadow coming this October. Jouet sends a sneak peek of the upcoming lip liners. Details to be announced. And Jeffree Star has announced via Twitter that he has a collab with Jouet coming soon. Details to come. Here's some late breaking news we thought you'd want to know. Black Moon Cosmetics sent a sneak peek of their upcoming Mini Moons details to come. Jackie Ina announced that she'll be working with Too Faced to help expand their Born This Way foundation line into deeper and darker shades. Wet n Wild sent these peeks at their new vividly colored fall limited edition Midnight Mermaid collection. Here you see lip shades, liner shades, and a flirty mermaid tail highlighter. Take a look at this gorgeously packaged holiday treat from Guerlain, a gold golden container of Mayteries. This circle of life is a sneak peek of the new Urban Decay Vice lipstick shades coming soon and Bessame is giving away a free warm tan foundation full size with any purchase, no code or link necessary. Ends Monday. And that's it for What's Up in Makeup this week. Thank you so much for watching and thank you as always to the beautiful and wonderful What's Up in Makeup official reporters and to Tab the Bee, my wonderful production manager. We had a week this week, so I thank all of you for hanging with us through the storms and everything. It was a crazy week getting this together, so thank you to everybody involved in the show. I appreciate you. Thank you to the What's Up in Makeup app reporters. Their names are scrolling here. The app is dying as soon as they allow me to kill it. So we are in the final stages of getting the Facebook group up and available for you to submit. I will get that information to you as soon as possible. If you want to know where you can buy anything in the show today, we do have everything every single week listed over at whatsupandmakeup.com. You can also see the what's on my face video to see how I got the look that I'm wearing on my face today. Hopefully you're watching the Makeup Minute Monday through Friday at noon. 60 seconds of news you can use. Chat will be today at 10 a.m. Eastern Time. Our chat today is inspired by a video that I watched by Tiffany Dawn. If you're not subscribed to her, you should definitely do that. Uh, it's going to be all about Sephora's most loved products, what they put up as their highest selling products. We're going to talk about those products and my experience with them, your experience with them, and decide whether they really should be best sellers or not, or if it's just all hype. So if you're interested in that, 10 a.m. Eastern time on the YouTube channel. If you just go to my channel, you should be able to find the live link around 10 a.m. So thank you again so much for watching What's Up In Makeup. I really appreciate it. Mad love and I'll see you in a video soon.